we take a look at the new ribbon up here for calendars, more and more Microsoft is trying to call things what you call them. So if the question is, how do I share my calendar, you click on something called Share Calendar in a group called Share. I love that one. You can email your calendar to somebody and choose to just send them your available dates or any amount of detail you like. You can change your view rather quickly. For those of you who like the scheduling view, you can see attendees and, and take a look at a scheduling view. Um, some of you may have noticed I have two time zones over here on the left. This is done in File, Options, Calendar. Now this should look familiar if you've ever been in Calendar Options before. It's all the same menus, except they're all on one screen now. And I have a Pacific time zone uh, shown as a second time zone. So I can choose not to show one or to show one, or I can rearrange how they show up, swap them and click up OK. So as I look at my calendar, uh, an appointment that was 10 a.m. Chicago time is 8 a.m. Pacific time, 4 and 2. We can only do two at a time. It does not appear in month view, of course, because we're not seeing our time slots, but a really kind of a nifty thing for dealing with uh, multiple time zones. <laughs>